Hey everybody, this is Crestle Snapdragon back again with another Mix It Up Bot tutorial. For this particular tutorial, I'm going to show you another set of advanced commands that are geared towards creating a game queue. So a lot of people, if you play games that are highly geared towards viewer interactions such as Fortnite or PUBG, and your viewers want to play the game with you, but you're running out of space, you can create a queue that they can join. So I'm going to show you how to do that. Mix it up is really nifty because it has it built in. So if you were to go to the sidebar and go to game queue, this is where the users list would be generated. You just have to enable it every time you go live. But you do have to manually create the command so that people can join the queue or leave the queue, look at their position in the queue, and you also wanna make a next command so that you can choose who's next in the queue and I'll show you how to do that. It's pretty easy. So you can see I already have four of them made here you'll have no trouble making them yourself, I promise. So you're gonna to go to new command, advanced command, action, and you're gonna to go to game queue. All you have to do is choose the game queue action. So let's say we wanna clear the queue at the end of the day. So we're gonna call this clear queue. We're gonna put it under the queue command group. Again, if you don't have a command group for the queue, you can choose a name for it, just write it in there, or you can leave it ungrouped. And then we want to choose a trigger. So the trigger is going to be clear queue, or just, just clear maybe. And then that's all you have to do, and you just save it. We're going to make it so that only mods can use this command, so only mods can clear the queue, and we don't really need a cooldown for it. But that's all you have to do, and now you're going to do it for all the other commands as well. So back to advanced command, action, game queue. You can disable the queue and enable the queue. So let's do enable. We'll do enable queue. And we'll also set this to only mods and save. Pretty easy. Back to advanced command. Let's look at what else we can do with the queue. I already have one for join the queue, leave the queue. You can also have the user look at the position in the queue. Let's do disable queue. Disable queue, command group queue. We're gonna say the trigger is disable. And we're gonna set it again to mods only and save. And now I have everything that I would need to be able to generate a queue. In order to allow people to join the queue, you're gonna go to advanced command again and choose the user join queue game action. To leave the queue, you want to choose the user leave queue action. To do next in queue, you're going to do, we're going to make sure only mods can do this one, but you're going to have select user at the front of the queue, but you can also do select a random user in the queue as well. So these are all the commands you need to generate a game queue in order to increase the interactivity with your viewers. Thanks for watching.